Hello guys. I'm here to discuss how I'm branching out my WordPress website, Steps to Growth. And you can do the same. I'm going to speak about content layout, the full width contained, and the full width stretched. I'm expanding on this website. As an example, you see these ads here. You see the web page if you really pay attention. This is a full width contained. It looks good. I like it on the front page. Here's another example. This is a full width contained. See that? See the ads? See how there's white, like a border around it? It's contained. On my letter shopping pages, I want to use full width stretched. You see the difference in the ad, how it's stretched out? The WordPress content management system is a responsive content management system. That means the ads, it, it, when you're building pages, a website using the WordPress content management system, it's responsive. So when a visitor views your website on a desktop, it will conform to the way you set it up and conform to the device that the viewer is viewing it. It will look different. It will it will be viewable pro it will be properly viewable on a desktop, a laptop, an iPad, a tablet, a smartphone, an iPhone. That's the whole point of using a responsive management a responsive content management system. And WordPress is that. Here's an example of a full width stretched. See how it's stretching? See how it, it fills in the whole, I'm on a desktop, fills in the whole browser window. That's what I want. This took about five to six hours to build this web page. This is Shop eBay video games and consoles. I should have closed that. There you go. This is another full width contained. This is Amazon products on this one. Now I want to show you something how I'm branching out. You see this is letter V shopping. See video games? I took two topics and I made two pages. I have it opened already. This is a this is an Amazon video games web page. This took me about 20 minutes to put together, 15 to 20 minutes. These pages are very, these are more simple. I say 20 minutes, more simpler to build. The way I'm choosing to build the template, the format. I even have these to visit search results at Amazon. You know, I'll show you, it's good to show you. And this one I have, Visit Featured Categories, because it's not just about showing the native ads on the page. I want to give it some more substance, some more beef. But this takes time, setting up all these codes that when a visitor clicks on the link, it brings them to exactly where you want them to be brought to. And then this one's a little different. It should be different. Is it? I do I did that? Oh yeah, the top's different, I see, I see, I see. But one's a search, one's a feature, oh it is different. There's Grubhub, it is different, okay. There's Grubby Hub. So, I also broke it down to, there's a lot to tell, I'm trying my best here guys. Letter V shopping, you got video game and consoles and video games. If I go to letter G, here we go, we have game consoles which opens up to this page again. This page was a lot of work, 
so I want to use it in several locations on my website and that's what I plan on doing so I have it listed underneath G2 as game consoles then I have gaming consoles and that's another Amazon page so I hope you learned something here you go through all the trouble to produce quality work especially something like this this took a lot of time you want to make sure that this URL is you know listed throughout your entire website several times if you can underneath different categories underneath different letters however you're choosing to build your website and here's another thing guys let me go here follow us on Facebook I created a store by dot shop Facebook page finally and Twitter handle store by dot shop Twitter allowed me to take an old Twitter account which held relevancy lotofcoupons.com and I turned it into storebuy.shop. It's about shopping. Soon it's going to be about food. It's about products. It, it matched. And I opened up a Facebook page for storebuy.shop. And these are all the things that I do that I will continue to do to expand, branch out, and grow the website. I hope you learned something. I hope I got my point across. You guys can do it. I love WordPress. It's an amazing, responsive content management system. And never give up. You too can build a store from the ground and can build a solid foundation and continue to build on it. And that's what I plan on doing. I hope you learned something. Have a good one, everyone. Any like?